Have you observed why iodized salt dissolves faster when it's submerged in hot water? This is all because of the rate of reaction. Now there are more factors affecting the rate of reaction. First, surface area. Surface area is the exposed matter of a solid substance. Imagine that you are holding a perfect cube of magnesium. The surface area is the sum of the area of all six sides of the cube. The surface area of the cube can be increased by dividing the cube into smaller cubes. Surface area is maximized when a single large cube is crushed to fine powder. By increasing surface area, there are more collisions per unit of time. That's why many solids are powdered using a mortar and pestle before being used in a reaction. Second, concentration. In terms of the collision theory, increasing the concentration of a reactant increases in the number of collisions between the reacting species per second and therefore increases the reaction rate. You can change the concentration of an aqueous species simply by adding more solute to make it more concentrated or adding more solvent to make it more dilute. Third, temperature. With the exception of some precipitation reactions involving ionic compounds in solution, just about all chemical reactions take place at a faster rate at higher temperatures. The question is, why? Temperature in Kelvin degrees is proportional to the kinetic energy of the particles in a substance. For example, if the Kelvin temperature of a substance is doubled, then the average kinetic energy of the particles in that substance is also doubled. At higher temperatures, particles collide more frequently and with greater intensity. Fourth, catalyst. A catalyst is a species that speeds up a chemical reaction without being chemically changed upon completion of the reaction. In other words, the mass of a catalyst is the same before and after a reaction occurs. Common examples of catalysts include MnO2 in the decomposition of H2O2, Fe in the manufacture of NH3, and Pt in the conversion of NO and CO to N2 and CO2. Created using Powtoon.